Since the dawn of time, the armies of heaven and hell have waged an endless war. Drawn to the conflict was the Chard Council, an entity bound by ancient laws to preserve order and balance. It held that any great power, unchecked, threatened the very fabric of the universe. In time, heaven and hell can do honor the Council and its laws, for none were beyond the swift and terrible justice of the Council's enforcers, a fearsome brotherhood known as the Four Horsemen. Amid the turmoil, the first humans emerged. The Council foretold that these weak but cunning creatures would someday be integral to the balance. Thus, a third kingdom was named the Kingdom of Man. By order of the Council, a truce was forged between Heaven and Hell. The Great Pact was bound by seven seals to be broken at the appointed time, when Man's Kingdom stood ready for the End War, a battle that would bring balance and determine the ultimate fate of the Three Kingdoms. Hey guys, Axton here, and welcome to a Hitchhiker's Guide to Darksiders. We'll just get these guys out of the way first, I think, before we continue on.
So Darksiders was released back in September 2010 by THQ and Vigil Games, which sadly no longer exists anymore, and was to be the first part of a quintology based on the Four Horsemen of the Apocalypse. So in this first iteration, we are playing as War, who heeded the call of apparently the Seven Seals being broken. Now, with this playthrough, we'll probably continue through and do a maybe a 100% pickup. It's very difficult in this type of genre to actually do a proper hitchhiker's guide as I'm planning on a starting with nothing and uh, finishing with everything kind of play. As uh, this game doesn't give you many options to really start with nothing from the beginning of the game. It gives you everything, takes it away and then you gradually get it back afterwards. But uh, there's a lot of pickups in the game. Seek a special piece of armor to pick up, like you uh, collect it in pieces, uh, and I believe a, a weapon as well. But uh, if you guys want to see a 100% playthrough of this game, just leave a comment and let me know, and uh, we'll go through and pick up as much as we can as we proceed. What is happening? So I'm going to try and attempt to play through the game with as minimal backtracking as possible and uh, if you guys aren't really fussed seeing 100% playthrough then uh, I may actually add a, a bonus episode to this series which will focus on the locations of all the items to pick them up um, so we've completed our first complete playthrough of the game. Those of you that aren't too familiar with the Darksiders canon or the Darksiders lore may be wondering why I'm fighting not only Demon but also Angel. Uh, the reason behind that is um, the uh, Horsemen are bound to the Council's law, and the Council's law is based on fighting, heaven and hell fighting, of course, uh, together, and of course. Uh, trying to save the Third Kingdom, which is, of course, the Kingdom of the Humans. Now, the reason War dispatches both Angels and Demons is because he really has no affiliation. So you can think of him more acting as a uh, more of a uh, peacekeeper for the council and has to eliminate angel and demon and try and protect all of the kingdoms.
helicopter loses that bout. Abaddon, what is this? Where are my brothers? This cannot be the, the final seal. My lord! How did this happen? Not broken! Abaddon! <sighs> what in heaven's name have you done? I answer the call. rather upset.
Good old fashioned poke in the eye. Thank <laughs> you.